Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Dynamics. Today we have the Honda Civic Type R from 2004. Let's get right into it. So, boom, here it is in front of us. You can see the amazing looking Honda Civic Type R from 2004. Uh, this is a 2 litre naturally aspirated engine generating 200 horsepower um, it has a obviously it has no turbos no superchargers which means it sounds like this of course we have upgraded some stuff so now it's running 324 horsepower and to get there we've upgraded the camshafts uh, the fuel system, uh, the air intake, and we've done the brakes as well. Obviously, the brakes are not going to make horse generate more horsepower, should I say? But it's going to help us stop. And you need better brakes when you have so much more power because that is what 124 horsepower, more than what they usually come at. So, I purchased this car for 36,000 credits. Now, for those who know, you cannot buy this from the actual store. You have to go into auction to get it and first the starting bid was at around 6,000 and I had four minutes left and I thought the bike price was 725,000 and I thought instead of paying that I'll just wait four minutes so we started bidding had a bidding war and I won for 36 around 36,000 I believe so let's get into place um, we are using the manual with the shifter and yeah uh, it is winter unfortunately so it, it is snowing at the moment it's not snowing but you can see it's frosty and it's going to snow which means it's going to be harder to put the power down especially now that we're using front wheel drive amazing touch control there wow 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 <laughs> well kidding that was really bad but you know what we have to upgrade the clutch as well because the literally the transmission it struggles well the transmission not so much but the clutch it slips a lot not as much as the other one the 97 um, plate one I can't remember which one it was I can't remember which Honda that was but that was literally just slipping on every gear so yeah so you might be looking at the colour thinking why have I chose that colour uh, the reason why I chose that colour is because my mate's got one he's got a silver one and I wanted to sort of match that just for the hell of it and this was the closest thing I could get to silver so yeah it does look a bit let's see Ooh, it's getting dirty now and we'll just go all, all over the bollards and whatever it is yeah so yeah he's getting dirty it's gonna get dirty straight away because it's pretty much white more than silver and the whole point of silver was you can't really you don't get dirty as much but then this is not really silver is it I don't know what you're gonna call it frost white pink blue whatever it is um, yeah it's a six speed gearbox you can see there we're in gear six now but let's not go in six gear man we're going 50 miles an hour let's go into second See that? You see that bad boy? Wow! Wow! You see that? Now we've upgraded because we've upgraded the camshafts. We get a higher red line so the red line is uh, just above 9000 to be honest that's why I did the camshaft and initially I was only going to do the camshafts because I wanted that extra screen because you all know these are screamers and yeah see that man it's literally it just it's just he's jealous that he's in a Ford and I'm in a Honda can't beat that sound man from a four cylinder It. I was gonna say tunnel, tunnel, tunnel. One thing about one, one good thing about starting there, where I always start, is that we always land in the tunnel because I always come the same way, don't I? Where is it? There it is. Are you ready for this tunnel? Indicate, indicate, squash that mini. 
we'll go fast to it and then we'll go slow and then we'll go from there. You ready? That's everyone going in my lane for. We've lost it, we've lost it, we've lost it. You know why we did that? You know why that happened? We can't drive. <laughs> so, I was going to go in sixth gear but I went in fourth. Was that 170 or something? Yeah man, let's go inside and see what's happening inside. So we've got the standard, 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 standard interior. Nothing new here, even the deck is an old deck. And I'll just blame the icy condition, you can see the ice. Yeah, so we've got, um, you know what's happened now, don't you? The gearbox has come off. <laughs> all that, sh all them granny shifts. But yeah, so, yeah, it's a standard interior. Um, you, I don't think you can change anything inside in this game. It would be good if you could, but we you can't. But it's nice just to see the standard classic interior because this is what they've always looked like. I mean, the O4 model, should I say. Nice dash. Obviously, I always play in this. I always tell you, I always play in this mode because this is how you are. Would you put this up if you were driving it? Sit into the Urus. What do you call that Urus and the Urus? Let me know in the comments. Wonder what sound we had. Yeah, so anyway, let's get to our idea. We're going to go into this mode. So, yeah, guys, I know this might be just like a completely random video, but literally, I just wanted to quickly jump in this car and do a video of it because you know what? This car is so special, and I'm so glad that I got it. But yeah, just for the hell of it, I thought, you know what? We'll get one of these. One car that I do need to get, but I can't find, is an E63S. Now, I saw one going for for two and a half million but I think that they only think it's sold it to sell it to someone because obviously if you want to sell it to someone you've got to auction it and they have to get it from that but uh, usually that's how it goes so someone will be like yeah do you who want to buy an E63S and they'll be like yeah me and then they'll auction it and then they'll give him it or maybe it was a giveaway who knows but uh, yeah I mean like come on that is sick Unfortunately, we can't find any of them. We found E63s, but we don't want the E63. We want the E63S, the DMO DJ one, don't we? We want that wrapped as well. Uh, obviously, I've got loads of C63s, but come on, we need the E63S. So if you've got one, let me know. And let's do some interaction with you lot as well, because I know you are thinking, what the hell's going to happen? So the person who has the funniest uh, comment with the most likes 
they get to race me and feature on a video so go ahead and comment guys and the person with the most likes will get to do it bear in mind you have to play Forza and then we'll do the club and then yeah we'll have to race but I'm coming and fun to race because you know what I'm not going to club um, yeah it'd be, it'd be fun to race man I know I'm babbling on now you want this car you don't want me but you know what I'm just saying what's going to happen on this channel wow this, this car is literally just, you can just drive it all day long especially with that sound come on Whoever has this G29 shifter, let me know if you have any issues with it because I have a bit of issues with the 5th and 6th here. That's why I couldn't go in the 6th because it was going to 4th because it didn't really go in until you do it a certain way. But I don't know if that's just driving because that used to happen to my actual Corsa in real life, which is strange. So, yeah, when I'm driving, I can't go into 5th. But I can, but it doesn't go in properly. If I'm not driving, I can. I don't know what it is but that happened, maybe it's just me but you know what, unfortunately that is happening so we have to be granny shifters sometimes but yeah man, come on let's do it some again but there it was okay Also, what's your favourite view in this game? Let me know. And tell me why. Please, there's a please. roads are really 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 slippy and I can feel it just normal driving if it, even if I let go if I don't put my foot on the brake or the accelerator just want to I love how you can see into it even though I've got black tints you can still see the dash you can see him changing the gear as well driving there now we I don't know where we are now and what I feel like this has updated or something because the graphics seem to look better than before I don't know if you've noticed that but even from the super video that I've uh, uploaded on Friday from there you can see that it, that looks okay so does this where before it look a bit I don't know less realistic more matte finish even though they were gloss but now the gloss is proper shining which is strange because I don't think I've done anything to the settings unless it's updated but yeah it is on my custom PC, so you never know. Sometimes it's there, sometimes it's not. Are you even a Civic uh, driver if you don't bounce it off the red line limiter? these mad roads even my other Honda video was in these conditions oh, wow. so yeah guys I think I'm going to end the video there because I've literally shown you what I can, can of this obviously we are in poor conditions so it is harder to put the power down but yeah that was a amazing Honda Civic Type R from 2004 if you want to buy it I'll sell it or I'll swap it for an E63 yes there you go there you go but yeah guys uh, thanks again for watching don't forget to like comment as well don't forget what we did what we were saying before the person with the most likes in the comment 
can actually do a video with me and you can be in this video so yeah guys thanks again don't forget to like comment subscribe and share if you want but you know it helps me uh, stay at home stay safe and peace